Natural catastrophes, epidemics, internal unrest or war cause human suffering every day. Those affected need medical assistance, they need shelter, clean water and food. Humanitarian aid in crisis regions needs to be fast, flexible and unbureaucratic. Coordination between organizations, be they the UN or non-governmental organizations, is more and more important and has increased over the years. Germany has done a lot to make sure that coordination works better. Germany does a lot on the international stage. The government has its own commissioner for human rights and humanitarian assistance. I think it's very important to distinguish between humanitarian assistance and development work. Humanitarian assistance is not bound up with politics, it's independent. And its goal is to help people to live in dignity after natural catastrophes or during civil wars. Good coordination saves time and resources. In Germany, 13 organizations are signed up to the Aktion Deutschland Hilft. Its job is to provide one channel of communication with the German Foreign Office in the case of an emergency abroad. On the ground, aid organizations coordinate via UN structures, but sometimes also via the German embassies, which then set up coordination sessions. Embassy assistance is just one tool that politicians have, and on-the-spot emergency aid is just one aspect of German development policy. As the number of crisis regions and catastrophes increases, we can see clear limits. That's why prevention is important, setting up structures in countries where you can see what the processes are, and helping people to prepare themselves, helping the countries too to react early enough, and not when it's too late. This is a key paradigm shift in humanitarian assistance, and for us it now takes centre stage. In concrete terms, this means you have to train people, teach them catastrophe protection measures, including technical skills, things like better buildings. It's all about preparedness. Catastrophe prevention is also a key task for organizations like the German Red Cross, which is currently providing aid in 50 countries. In our experience, one euro spent on disaster prevention is the same as four euros spent later on emergency aid. Assistance costs money. The number of people and regions in urgent need of humanitarian assistance continues to grow. More immediate aid and more prevention mean more support. We get a lot of support from Germany. Over the years, it has increased significantly. Germany has become one of the UNHCR's most important donors. In 2013, for example, the German Foreign Office made 360 million euros available for humanitarian assistance, while also boosting investment in preventative assistance.